That's Princess right there. And that's Ichigo. Did you get a haircut? Yep. Okay. Every yeah. once a month. Once a month. Okay. Cause you your hair looks a little bit different than last time. I because I colored it too. You colored it? I get a haircut and a color every four weeks. It's pretty Otherwise, snappy. I'd be silver. Oh, okay. Oh, well, nothing wrong with that. <laughs> so every four weeks, that's what happens. It doesn't last long. The sun dies it out real quick. Oh. Makes it fade real quick. What color did what color did you? Usually it's like a it's supposed to be like a blonde, but I think it's more like a brown. Oh, okay. Yeah. My my wife always wanted to dye her hair blue. Blue? Yeah. She's uh, she's got black hair. She's Hispanic, and so she always wanted to have some blue in her hair. But they when every time they dye it, it always turns green for some reason. It's like the blue just says, "No, we're gonna not do what you want to do, and we're gonna some, change green." Some colors, if you put it in and get into like a swimming pool, mm -hmm. it'll make it turn colors. Okay. I don't know if it's the chlorine yep. or what it is, but it makes. I've seen people, they've shown pictures of people getting their whole head dyed, and they go to Florida and they get in the pool. Wow. It huh. turns a different color. Wow. What, huh. girl? What do you want? What? Well, I'll tell you this, Don, but uh, I wouldn't recommend this uh, to dye your hair. When I had my accident, when I fell and landed on my head, yeah. uh, I got this. Oh. This white, this white in the front. Yeah. And it's always, it's, I've had it for 30 years now, over 30 years, and it's, it was never that way before, but. Settle down, yep. Well, you wound up today. Man, everybody's wound up today. Yeah, it's kind of funny when that happens, ain't it? Yeah. Crazy. Yeah, settle down. Let's settle down. Settle down, big girl. Settle down. Settle down. I think I landed on this side of my head, like this area right here. Yeah. And then, but then, if a, you landed on this side of your head, you would think it would dye your hair this there. area. Yeah. Not up there, but I don't know. Yeah. What are you looking for? What are you looking for? Huh? What are you looking for? I think Christy's kicking me out watching this one. He's just telling me to go home. Oh, all right. I was here yesterday till two. Oh, okay. I'm not young anymore. Can your body handle it, man? Well, I gotta come back tomorrow. I do three days in a week. And I get tired. But then I get four days to rest. It takes all four days. <laughs> <laughs> yep, yep. That's why I do a day on, a day off, a day on, a day off, and then. 
most people, what they'll do, like Gail's car, she'll do Thursday, Friday. Just be done. Yeah. It feels good to do it. It's just, it's really good for your, for your, for your head and for your heart. But then at the same time, it's not so great for your body, you know. <laughs> so. I used to do a Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Then I went Monday, Wednesday, because Christy did Rough Riders on Friday. So they had a lot of people on Friday. I told her, I'm going to go to Saturday. If they need more help on Saturday, she said, that'd be a good idea. So I was Monday, Wednesday, Saturday. Then COVID hit. And they had you divide it up into three and a half days. Mm -hmm. Monday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, and a half a day, Wednesday. Okay. Or a half a day Wednesday and Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Oh, so you're so on. I got that. into the 30, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. All right. And the Wednesday, they discontinued because one week you'd go in the morning, and the next week you'd have to go in the evening. Mm -hmm. And then Wednesday, I don't know what they did with that, but that. And I've never, I just stayed at Thursday, Friday, Saturday. I don't know why, but. Hmm. Well, I hope you can keep doing it, man. I don't know. Well, Christy helps sticking me in the yard. Okay. That helps me. Yeah. Like I used to put in 9, 10, 11, 12 miles a day before I started doing the yard. Mm -hmm. I like oh, today, okay. four miles. Oh, yesterday, so you, yesterday was four miles. So you got like a tracker? How does yeah. that work, man? I don't know. You got the app. You put the app in and you stop it or you start it. Okay. See, today is 4.07. Sat last Saturday was five, Sat Friday was six, Thursday was four, and then three, six, four. Depends, but. Maybe it's maybe it works off of the jostling in your it, pocket. It must. When you move? Uh, yeah. Oh. Yeah. I love that guy, even though he's a knucklehead. I love him, man. Yeah. Oh, he's, now he's calm. He's getting worked up, though. Now she's going to get pushy. Now yeah, they're both going to want to be fed. Uh oh. This, uh, this is where the trouble starts. Yes. You don't want to get What are you want to get for? What are you doing? What are you. Oh, my goodness, my goodness. What are you doing? Get down, big girl. Get down. You're right there. You're not skinny. Yes, you're warmed up today too. Good, hello. Oh, nice. Oh, we can chase the bird. It's yeah. funny when they were, well, they were giving, we split up in groups and did the shots for the disease. Mm -hmm. And we were in ISO and he was back over there. Two, two people come and got me. We couldn't get him out. Wow. He was growling and snarling. Oh, Chuck a doodles. Wow. But then I finally got the leash on him and we were fine. It took me it took me a little while. Uh -huh. I finally got the leash on him, but then we were okay. Okay. He went out, got a shot, it was fine. Maybe it's that isolation that's just yeah. not Yeah, and sometimes they he was like that before. But so maybe it was maybe it was the shot is that what you were saying or maybe it's no i don't okay. he just came over i thought i told him i said he's really scared he might have a problem getting the shot it's fine that's cool what, what well, he knew doing? you he probably knew you so. what are you doing yeah you were snarling it took me Seven, eight minutes to get him to get the leash on him. Uh -huh. When I got the leash on him, no, off we went. We were fine. Huh. He, what are you doing? He probably thought after that, he probably thought you were the best thing since sliced bread. They say if you're if you the first one to leash him up in the kennel, they never forget you. Wow. Okay. I've had dogs that people couldn't get out. And I leash them ah, up. I yeah. leash them up. You never have a problem with them again. Doesn't Other people still do. Doesn't that feel good man? to know that you can that you can 
we're, we're, we're the dog that, that's kind of difficult for other dogs, yeah. other, other people to work with. It's just a, it's just a, the, it's like the energy that you put off the truck. Your demeanor and... There was one, I remember, Shepard Mixon that was in the pause and I finally got it out. Uh -huh. But they, the purple dot walk around, whatever night it was, I think it was a Thursday night, they were all gone. And nobody could get him out. So I came all the way down and got him out. But that was fine, he got out. Good. There was a big black shepherd, really nice looking. Mm -hmm. One guy says, I can't get him out. I said, okay, let's go away. He said, I'm gonna watch you. That way, I took me talking and talking and doing different stuff. And finally, I got the leash over his head. He got out the big gate, he jumped up and gave me a hug. Oh, we were that's best nice. buddies after that. <clears throat> that's wonderful. But then some people still couldn't get him out. Yeah. I know they wanted him in the clinic. And Christy says, Don, they want Bella in the clinic. Can you take him over? I said, yeah, I'll take him. I took him over and I put him in the riding car. He was fine. Yeah. It's just they, I don't know, they just sense they know him. Then on the other, on the on the reverse side of the coin, there's some dogs that they just do not like me. There's something about me that they just it could be the chair freak out about. It yeah, could be the wheelchair. No, we brought Ari in. The little one had long ears. He didn't want nothing to do with it. Right. And it could be the chair. I mean, it's something it's different that it's you like just, some are scared of bikes. So and if you want to also just make the yeah. green. Uh, you can just make available because they're not on the list. Yeah. Alright. Chasing the birds? Okay. See chasing the birds, okay. huh, big girl? You're not getting on my, no, you're not getting on my lap. The you don't need no more treats. You need to lose a few pounds. Yes. You need to lose a few pounds, big girl. Yes. Yes, big girl. Yeah, there's one at, T, at TRN that uh, just hates wheels. Yeah. Just. She's always keep an eye on the wheels. Of, you know, Ginger is her name. Oh. I don't know if you've seen Ginger or not. Well, I I hope that I hope that whenever I get to Get to seventy. I, I don't know. How is it? Seventy-two. Turn seventy-three in September. That's a, I, I I think that I think that's a beautiful. Uh, I mean, you do do other things because you got to make money and stuff like that. But then, you know, it's nice, and you know and. When the, whenever you're over the hill to kind of do things that you're really, really, that feel good. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's, I mean the doctor always says, well, what do you do for exercise? And I tell her, she says, hey, you keep it up. Yeah. <laughs> she says, you're doing fine, keep it up. That's, yeah. That, were you there whenever I said that? Because you guys brought me two. And you said, and Christy said, no, they're too, yeah. too big pull. Yeah, took them over to the yard. Yeah. They were a handful. And I, 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 I sat with them. I, they were. I and said, you know, they kind of calmed down, and they did a lot of walking and pacing, but they weren't really hyper. Uh-huh, And then, okay. brown one, he came over and I petted him. Now we're stimulated right away. Oh, okay. So I had to shoot him his foot out. Well, and the black one came over, I petted him, and he was fine, but then the brown one had come running over. Right, okay. But they were, they were a little amped up in there, but they did okay. <clears throat> they did okay, huh? Yeah, that, the, I was going to say that pulling and, 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 uh, and, uh, and pushing and stuff like that, um, it puts a lot of workout on your muscles, man, you know, so. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's true. That's why Christy usually takes the harder one. Tell her I'll take the I'll take the heart. No, you're not. <laughs> and, her, and she's jumping around 
because she got whacked in the knee by one of them dogs. Oh, got whacked okay. in the knee. I think it was one of them dogs. She got whacked in the knee. And now she's limping around. Oh. Uh, I remember one day her knee was bothering her. It still is. Okay. The last weekend she was off, and they went hiking. Oh. Because she said something today about, I think I might have just overdid it last week. <sighs> Everybody's different, right? Yeah. yeah, my back's been bad for years. If I had to, if I had to walk Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, I couldn't do it. My body, my back wouldn't let me do it. Uh -huh. My back would give out. So I told Christy, I told her, you know, I, I just can't do it. I can't walk anymore. So I will stick you in the yard. I said, well, then I'm not doing it. She's done. You're sitting with two dogs. You're taking, it's taking two people to do them, and you're doing it. Yeah. So that's what I've been doing probably for a year. Better than nothing, you know. I get a lot of pairs on it, a lot of pairs. But otherwise, it would take two people. And she gives me the the tougher pairs. Mm -hmm. That way, if there's a problem, I can handle it. Yeah. Oh, that's your squirt bottle, right? Yeah. That's I'm, your bottle. I'm the purple. Yeah.